next little YouTube video using my iPhone, quick and dirty again. Sorry about that. Um, don't have time to set up, but uh, hopefully this helps some people. A lot of people order blinds and they have trouble cutting them, um, and they a lot of times take a wrong measurement. So that's not a good good way to go. You want to measure inside your supports. Uh, from inside the support to the other inside of the support so you get, and leave a little bit of play uh, 16th of an inch minimum sometimes you need more and even taking a measurement of the window walls they're not always flush sometimes they curve a little bit so making sure the blind doesn't hit um, the walls because you run into a lot of issues cutting blinds one of the easiest ways I know to cut this blind pretty straight is to actually use some painters tape and wrap it up tight and then I'll have to hold the other side with my hand. I've seen people use uh, small battery operated uh, circular saws, uh, use hacksaw. <laughs> um, a little quicker for me is uh, actually my battery operated sawzall, my Milwaukee M12 uh, fuel sawzall. Okay, so I'm, I got a red line here. I made a mark 38 inches. It's a pretty tight fit, 38 inches, so I'm gonna hair under at least a 16th of an inch under. I have a trash can here because most of it's gonna fall on the floor. And it's a lot of stuff more than you think. Makes a mess too. And there's a little cap that came on here. So I took it off so when I cut I can put it back. I don't lose the little cap that came with, okay? That should be about it. Pretty happy with that. That came out pretty straight. Um, zero issues with that. Uh, the tape definitely helped hold everything together while I cut it. Um, everything fell in the garbage can, not half on the floor this time. So I think that came out okay. I hope this quick and dirty video is enough illustration to help you guys cut your blind, taping it up, uh, illustrating taking the correct measurement from the inside of the window or inside the supports. And definitely check the window because they're not always straight. Some of them are off and you'll put the blind in, it'll be perfect on top, but it'll rub against the sides. You don't want that. You want to avoid that, okay? Hopefully that's enough today. I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye.